Grade 8 Math, number 6.1e, identify functions from the vertical line test. All through 6.1, we've talked about how a function assigns exactly one output for each input, and how we can think of a function as a machine that works by a rule that it must obey. And the rule is the relationship between the input x and the output y. So this 4x machine says that whatever x is is going to be multiplied by 4, and that's what the output will be. So remember, a function relationship is a function rule, like this one's rule is 4. Well, since each value of x, each input, leads to only one value of y, an output, in a function, any vertical line drawn through the graph of a function must intersect the graph in one point at most. So this is called the vertical line test for a function. What does this mean? It means draw a vertical line through the point. You know, vertical is going up and down. If the line crosses more than one point, it's not a function. So, we made pink vertical lines, okay, like this. And they were drawn through these points. If the pink vertical line crosses more than one point, like here it did two, then it's not a function. Here it was only one, here it was only one, so yes, these outside ones were functions. This one crossed two, so it's not. So take a look at this. This one's not a function because there's one, two, three, four points. I don't know if you can see these points real well, but there's four points on this line. See? And the line was kind of curvy. And we drew the pink line through it and it hit it four times. See that? In this one, this is a function because even though this is kind of a zigzag of a line, the pink line went through it one time, one time, one time, one time. So yeah, that is a function. Let's look at this one. We drew a lot of vertical, vertical lines to see if this was a function, and this one went through one time, one time, one time, one time, one time. So yeah, that would make a function. This one, uh-oh, one, two, it went through it twice. One line went through two points, so it's not a function. So the graphed lines may take many shapes. They might be zigzags, circles, ovals, polygons. We're going to do that in the future. On these coordinate planes, we're going to be drawing figures and stuff. So they could take many shapes. So we do the vertical line test, and if the points don't pass the vertical line test for a function, we know the relationship is not a function. See? That's a really easy way, isn't it? It's like when we graphed them in the last video and we could see that there was one on top of the other. That's all it is, and we're just making a vertical line running through it to prove it, okay? The vertical line test sounds like it's a lot harder than it really is. Just draw a line through the points, a straight vertical line, and if you cross a point more than once, it's not a function, okay? So we're going to go on to the next topic, and we're going to keep talking about functions, so I'll see you there. Bye.